Hartbury's rapid rise through the league structural means that there is one player at the club that played for the college side when they were in Gloucester too. Matt Gilbert played for four seasons with Hartbury after joining the university as a fresher in 2005 and achieved four promotions in that time with the club moving into Southwest one West as he left. Since then Gilbert, who is hearing impaired and has played for the England Def Rugby team, has gone on to play for Bath, Worcester and the Scarlets. Matt Gilbert of Hartbury he rejoined Hartbury last season and will run out for the club in the championship after running out for them in Gloucester two 12 years ago. Gilbert said it was the second year that Hartbury was in existence that played for them. I was a fresher, we had a lot of good players and just went up through the leagues. I've always kept a close eye on the club, I loved my time here originally and always thought that come the end of my career I would like to come back here. Ross Moriarty Johan Ackerman has brought a fresh mentality to the team in line with their achievements on the field, the college has grown off it with the facilities ever expanding. Matt Gilbert playing for Hartbury the 31-year-old added the college is always on the up, with the amount of quality and talent that comes through here the club is always going to be successful. Gloucester have moved out into their own premises which is great for them but when I was a student it was quite nice to use the same gym that Mike Tyndall used. The construction is still going on now, the place is growing all the time. More academies are developing as well, it's not just rugby, the rowing and the girls football is doing well at the moment. Gilbert is approaching 150 appearances for Hartbury having played five seasons for the club across two stints with the club. Hartbury player Matt Gilbert are in Hartbury principal outside the Galloping Barista along with Dan Murphy and Reese Oakley. Gilbert is helping to use his experience at the top level of the game add to Hartbury. He said I have been fortunate to play for some good clubs and under some good coaches. Mark Cornwell respects that, he is a very good coach and has a lot of knowledge himself but he does appreciate that people like me, Dan Murphy and Reese Oakley have been in the Premiership environment. He allows us to have an opinion in training and analysis. HE is very receptive to that and that can make us stronger as a team by pooling everyone's experiences from world-class coaches that we have all had. Gloucester Rugby announced their club captain for the 201,718 season. The flanker played in the championship with Worcester Warriors when they were promoted to the Premiership in 2015. Hartbury squad for the 201,718 season. We found the championship very forward dominated and forward orientated with Worcester, said Gilbert. That was my concern coming into this year but we have strengthened with Dan Murphy and Rupert Harden who give us that experience of playing top-level rugby. We showed against Worcester that we could cope and we took the game to them. Our backline can cause trouble for teams, we know that, it is just about giving them good ball and we have more than enough capabilities to match these championship packs. Away from the pitch the flanker has set up a new business venture called the Galloping Barista. Gilbert has converted a horse box into a coffee shop that will sell hot drinks and cake to spectators at Hartbury's home games this season. Hartbury player Matt Gilbert has made his own coffee unit called the Galloping Barista. He said I don't even like coffee but I spent the off-season converting a horse trailer into a coffee van. The boys are enjoying it, they all get a coffee after training before they go to the gym. I was watch Exeter Loughborough in the university semi-finals last year and they had a coffee van there. I just thought we don't have anything like this at Hartbury, so got in touch with the principal Russell Marchant about getting one at Hartbury. The cakes are being made by the wife of Hartbury BUCS coach Sean Lynn and Gilbert has received plenty of positive reviews about the cakes. He added it has been good fun doing it and it has been quite a sociable job which is nice. We'll see how it goes, this will stay here at Hartbury now and hopefully we will get into the equine events too. If the opportunity comes up to convert a second horse trailer then I will.